How's it going guys? Here I have a 2020 Toyota Tundra SR5 in the double cab option. Now if you guys uh, opt out for a double cab Tundra, you guys can get it in the standard standard bed or long bed or long bed at 8.1 foot. This is uh, equipped with the TSS package, the truck sport series. Uh, so you get the black uh, wheels, 20 inch black wheels all black badging black uh, running boards and with the added tires right there all-terrain tires black exhaust TSS off-road decal now on certain trucks you guys can opt out and you guys can add the Tundra in um, black inlays or chrome inlays on that one just check your accessories um, tab when you guys look go through toyota.com beautiful day here in texas <laughs> clear as i've mentioned before if you guys want a package like this with the tss you have to go through uh, you have to be living in one of the five states um that gulf states produces accessories and um parts for them which uh, again um Headquarters is based in Houston and then also Mississippi, Louisiana, Oklahoma, and Arkansas. So if, you, if you're in any of those states, you guys can um, build a truck like this. If you go to Toyota.com under accessories, you'll see um, the package like this that you guys can build. This is a TSS, um, the black edition, so you get the black wheels, but you also get another one, um, a special edition, which gives you uh, chrome wheels if you want that. But go ahead and check that out. <clears throat> so you guys already know um, this one's in cavalry blue exterior you can you guys for this year you, you can also get it in um, Buddha blue for those who are interested Buddha blue is now available it's pretty much available for any tundra for the Buddha color except for the SR I like the stance on this double cab. They, you guys already know they got rid of the 4.6 uh, engines for the Tundras as well as the flex fuel engines. Uh, this is the last one they're using right now, 5.7. And uh, have you guys heard any rumors of uh, 2021, maybe 2022? Um, they're saying maybe there's a B6 Tundra hybrid producing maybe up to a 40 miles per gallon. Um, more and more reports are saying that and this is correct but we're just gonna have to wait and see right this one's equipped with toyota safety sense like all toyotas do um, lane departure dynamic radar cruise control pedestrian detection this one's uh, the sr5s you get the nice chrome bumper chrome surround and a, a gray gray grill in the middle Some people prefer uh, color matching. You can get the TRD Sport for that or a Tundra TRD Pro to have the color match and possibly the Platinum one too. So this one has also the, um, the new feature. It has the eight inch touchscreen in the, in the inside for 2019, 2020. Sorry about that. It comes with a premium audio. It comes with the audio plus so there is um, no navigation on this one. There's no JBL sound system. If you guys want something that's called a remote connect where you guys can turn on the car and, and turn it off, you guys have to uh, get a package that's called um, Premium Plus navi with navigation and, and it has to have the JBL system on there. And it pretty much comes from the Tundra 3D Pro, the 1794 Tundra and the Platinum one. This truck here with the double cab and the, and the wheels and the TSS package, you're looking at 47,568 with uh, all the added options, which this one they added a spray on bed liner. It has a safe inside the car. The TSS package. And also has a connectivity kit and a power tailgate lock. So on this one, once you add that option, you guys can lock the tailgate just using the keys, it'll lock it. 
I don't know if you guys heard that, but I'm unlocking it right now. And uh, you guys know Tundras and Tacomas, they have the easy, easy gate drop. So it won't slam down like other trucks do. It just comes down and easy. Nice spray on bed liner. Double caps do not come with a rear window, electronic windows in the back. So you have to do that manually. A lot of you guys are interested in seeing the <clears throat> the gas caps right here. There still has a string on it. Same thing for the Tundra TRD Pro. It comes like that. It does not have a lock, so you just have to open it like that. There you go. Black outside mirrors. On this one, it has the SR5 upgrade package, which they uh, it's a 38 um, bigger gallon. It has the downshifter in the bottom instead of on the steering wheel. You also get these power seats right here for the SR5 upgrade package, four way with the lumbar support. Automatic high beams right there. And the, the, you guys can see they took away the electronic rear window. And if you guys did adjust, um, if you had some cargo bed lights in the back, you guys can turn it off, on and off from here. No leather wrapped steering wheel, but of course the, on the SR5 model, you guys can pick and choose and build it how you guys want it. Many different uh, options and variations. Let me know what you guys think of this package here with the cavalry blue. I have not seen one in Buddha blue, otherwise I would have picked that one out so you guys can see it. Let's take a look at the back of the double cap. Okay, let's open this up on this one. Got some nice little compartment right there. That's pretty cool. Just can put a couple of handguns in there or whatever you guys want. The seats on this one, I don't believe they go down on this one, so that's why you have the compartment down here. Uh, no no uh, armrest right here in the back. You get a power outlet, and then we got two cup holders right here in the rear. I'll show you guys up in the front, that's the way you guys can just see it. So that one over there, and the double cap is missing the, the arm, the grab handles right there for the passengers in the back, and also the grab handle for the passenger on this side in the back. As well as the drivers, you guys already know, there's no grab handle there. It's been like that for a couple of years, a few years back. And I'll just jump in one more time just to show you the, the front, in case this is your first time you're seeing a 2020 Toyota Tundra. And uh, following my videos, make sure you uh, subscribe, give the video a like, and comment below what you guys want to see next. This is the key for the SR5. I'm going to turn the truck on right now. Got a nice little Tundra and the 4.2 inch information center. It's 94 degrees outside right now. I'm just gonna go ahead and do the go through the information center one more time. That way, I'll turn the music down before I get a copyright. There we go. That's the screen right here. It does come with Apple CarPlay and um, Android Auto. I'll show you guys the buttons right there. Trailer brake output. Got the AC controls right here, the fan. Cold or hot, simple. That's what thing about uh, Toyota is uh, reliability and it's an easy, friendly user. You get in, you know what you you know what to do. Here's the armrest right here with the SR5 upgrade package. It has a safe right there from Ghost Safe Toyota. Couple of cleaning products in there. All right, guys, I'm gonna step back one more time. The way you guys can see the truck, so I can close out the video. I 
I also have a new mic that I purchased. Uh, let me know if, how the quality sounds. Check out the clouds. Halogen headlights, halogen uh, fog lights, and LED uh, daytime running lights on the SR5. All right, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't yet. And until the next time, take care.